All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you the best bunch blitz in the entire game. This is going to get instant pressure sending three people. It's going to come in whether they max protect, whether they delay fade, whether they block a running back. It does not matter. You're going to send three. I also like to send four out of this, but you can send three. It's going to be very effective. This is out of the nickel 335 will. Now, if you want to get my entire nickel 335 will defensive ebook, it is finished. It is on sale as of right now. I just launched it. And guys, I just have to tell you, this is a phenomenal, phenomenal defense. Also, it's if you guys want to get a free sample of the defense, text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. I've got a one-hour free sample. So if you want to get access to that, just text the word Madden to the number at the top of the left of your screen. And again, like I said, guys, this blitz is absolutely incredible. So let's just jump right into the video. You're going to run out of this, out of the cover four palms. You can do this out of any play in this formation, but I like the cover four palms the best because I like to run match defense. If you don't like to run match, then you could do the same thing out of a cover two sink if you would like. So again, I'm using the cover four palms. The setup is really simple. Literally all we're going to do, actually real quick, I've got to turn auto flip on. I apologize. Uh, so make sure your auto flip is on. Uh, for this blitz and then I'm going to reset the play so again like I said you're going cover four palms auto flips going to be on and it's really 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 easy to set this up so all we're going to do is we're going to show blitz we're going to blitz this linebacker right here Thompson okay and then we're going to QB contain and pretty much the blitz is set up but what I like to do is take that linebacker on the left side of the screen and man him up on the running back. So you see here, this is kind of what the blitz looks like. And at the snap of the ball, what you're going to see is we're going to get instant gap pressure just like that. Really, really, really good gap pressure. And that's only sending four. So let me show you how you could get the same exact pressure sending uh, three. So again, just blitz that linebacker, QB contain. I like to go ahead and show blitz. Um, you want to show blitz first, I apologize. But anyways, uh, we'll just drop that backside guy. And... Uh, you should see we're going to get easy pressure off the edge, just like that. Now, either the edge guy or the or the linebacker is going to come free, okay? So now what they're going to do, the very first thing that they're going to do is they're going to block a running back. So uh, how does this blitz work against a blocked running back? Well, I think the blocked running back is honestly the best way that you could possibly pick this blitz up. I'm going to go ahead and go back to that three-man pressure, and what you'll see is if they block the running back, you see every now and then they are able to pick this up, but that's partially because with your user, what you want to do is you want to run down into the running back side. You don't want to run down into the tight end side like I just did. So uh, we're going to just man up the running back, drop this guy. So you see here, here's the defense or the, the defense. Yep. We're going to stand kind of right here, run down into the left, just like that. And as you see, that guy should have got in right there. He did get picked up, but he should have got in. Um, you want to put a guy in Mutt, he will get in, and here's why. You want to put the best, like, agility guy there or pursuit. Like, you want the guy to have good change of direction because he's basically looping through that pressure. So as you see right there, there's the pressure. Real good, real consistent, real good. So the worst thing that the opponent – or let me show you one more time blocked running back just to show you we can get this in against that. So, again, here – and drop that guy in the zone. And what you'll see, blocked running back. Pressure comes in, or I guess it did get picked up, so let me show you one more time. Um, practice mode is being a little bit weird because we've been running this blitz a lot, so just bear with me on this. But again, you're only sending three people, um, you know, so it's not like the end of the world. If you send the four-man, it's pretty much guaranteed. Uh, and that's why I say I like the four-man the best. The blocked running back is the best way they have a chance at stopping this. There you see. And that's what we're supposed to be getting the whole time. So that's the blocked running back. I'll show it to you one more time just to show that it's not fluke. Again, most of the time you're going to get this in if, if they block their running back. You're definitely going to get this in if they block their tight end or if they delay fade. And, of course, as I say that, the running back comes over and picks this up. But you see the idea. The, the blitz is very good. So now let me move on. Let me talk about a delay fade. This is what makes this blitz special. So the number one way that most people like to pick up blitzes, especially from bunch this year, is they like to delay fade their backside guy. So you see here, we're only sitting three. We've delay faded the tight end. Watch what this does to that. You're going to see you're going to get Isaiah Simmons instantly free every single time. This is one of the beauties of the 3-3-5 wheel formation. You cannot delay fade your tight end. You cannot max protect. And you cannot block your tight end. If you do either of those three things, you will get screamed at every single time. So let me show it one more time. Again, QB contain. I'm going to drop this guy. And I'm going to delay fade the tight end. I'm going to stand kind of right here. And what you'll see is we should come in complete. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to blitz the linebacker. My bad. I forgot to blitz the linebacker on that side. So let me show you that one more time. 
Again, we're just going to show blitz, blitz the linebacker on that side, QB contain, and then I like to man that backside linebacker up on the running back, and then you can drop this guy into whatever zone that you want, uh, that DT on that right side. And as you see, this pressure is really, really good. So now where this pressure goes gets even better is if they max protect. So if they max protect, you're thinking, well, surely that's going to stop this blitz. Absolutely will not stop this blitz, which I think is really, really cool. So uh, a max protect is also not going to stop this. So again, you see there, Isaiah Simmons loops around, completely clean at the quarterback. We're sending three people, and we're getting instant pressure against bunch max protect. And guess what? It's actually from the bunch side. This is one of the places that they don't expect the pressure to come from in this formation. So let me show it to you one more time. Again, uh, I'm going to show blitz here, and you see I like to bluff blitz that backside guy. I think it does help the pressure. But you see right there, there he goes again, looping around. And that's why I really love this blitz is because it comes in no matter what they do. But what's really cool is max protect. And by max protect, I'm not saying block the running back and put the running and put the uh, tight end on a delay fade. I'm saying block both of them. This is considered the best protection in Madden. And what you're going to see is this is going to pretty much nine times out of ten come completely free. Sometimes every now and then, and normally it's in practice mode that I've noticed, because in game mode, I've got some clips that I'm going to show you here that make this absolutely insanely effective. So I'm going to show you a couple of gameplay uh, film, uh, a gameplay tape here. Um, this is actually what you can get just sitting four uh, against five wide. So again, just check these out. Guys, this defense is absolutely insanely effective. It's it's probably it's one of my most favorite guides I've ever written because it's centered around match defense, which I absolutely love. But the beauty of it is, if you take a look here, you're going to see you get some of the flukiest pressure, some of the glitchiest uh, four down lineman rushes that I've ever seen. As you see right there, we get uh, completely clean A-gap pressure sending uh, only four people. Uh, I'll show you here. This is edge pressure sending the same base rush, basically. And what you're going to see is Diablo is going to basically absolutely scream, as you can see right there, against the five wide. So this formation is absolutely insane. I can't stress to you enough how much I really am in love with this defense. I think this is one of the better defenses uh, in the entire game, not just because of the, the fact that you can get really glitchy pressures like what I just showed you, but the fact that you have coverage like that, that you're going to be able to consistently rely upon uh, to be able to basically shut down anything that the offense wants to do. So I want to thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. This is how you can get absolute insane pressure with the nickel 335 wheel formation. If you want to get my full nickel 335 wheel defensive ebook, it's on sale in the description below or in the comment section. You can get a link to it uh, for just 15 bucks. Thanks for your time. I hope you enjoyed the, the video and we'll see you guys later.